Hi everyone! Today I'll be teaching you how to merge Word, DocX documents in Power Automate. As a reminder, this will work the same way in Logic Apps as well. To perform this flow, we will be using a Cloudmersive document conversion connector. But before we get started, remember to like and subscribe for more tutorials on using Cloudmersive connectors in Power Automate and Logic Apps. To start our flow, we'll first need to click Create on the left-hand side of the Power Automate homepage. Then, choose Instant Flow and manually trigger a flow. Then press Create. Once you've reached the flow page, you can start adding new steps. We first need to get our file content from your preferred file drive. Here, you will enter in the first Word document that you want to merge. Then, we will add a second action for getting file content from your file drive. This will contain your second file for merging. Now that we've gathered all of our files, we'll add in a Cloudmersive document conversion connector. From the list of actions, we'll choose to merge two Word DocX documents together. Note that if you've never used one of our connectors before, you will be prompted to enter your API key. This is free on the Cloudmersive website with no commitment, and once you've entered it here, you won't be asked for it again. The first input file should be the file that you would like to appear first in your merged document. I'm naming this file input1 followed by .docx. The second input file should be whatever file you'd like to appear second. I'm naming this file input2 and once again followed by .docx. Our final action should be the create file option for your file drive. Choose your desired folder path. Then add in your desired output name followed by .docx. Finally, we can add in our output content from the document conversion action. Once you've completed these steps, we can save our flow. To run the flow, click Test in the upper right-hand corner. Then choose the option that says I'll perform the trigger action. Then press Test and Continue, and then click Run Flow and Done. After clicking Done, you will see green check marks next to all of the connectors showing that the flow worked. Sometimes it takes a second or two for all of the check marks to appear, so don't stress if that happens to you. If your flow doesn't work for some reason, check to make sure your original input file was valid for the connector, meaning it was a docx file, and that the names you chose for your files throughout the flow were followed by their file type, .docx. Now you can check your chosen folder for your newly merged Word document. Thank you so much for watching, and be sure to subscribe and check back in for more tutorials and tips on using Cloudmersive connectors in Power Automate.